In the last three months, more than 11,000 migrants have spent the night at Travis Park Church as they seek asylum here in the United States. And many arrive here with practically nothing. And that's why a mother and daughter are hoping to change that as they get some much needed help on a project they call a labor of love. Eyewitness News reporter Jalisa Idizadi has that story. A glimpse inside Travis Park Church will quickly prove it's more than a place of worship. While some of its rooms offer solace, others provide purpose. Welcome. Come on in. Today, Kathleen Labordi's workshop is doing a little bit of both. Yes, isn't it fabulous? We first introduced you to Kathleen and her daughter Isabel at their San Antonio home, where an idea to help migrant children was born. The duo would make dolls the children can play with and sleep on through their travels. We want them to look at these little faces and say, oh, that's that's a friend. That's that's. That's my pal. Now, just a few short weeks and 50 dolls later. We've had quite a few come in. The idea has turned into a well-oiled machine as others like Sharon Young join in on the efforts. I mean, I, I was homeless for quite a while, so I can kind of relate to not having much and coming somewhere to this church where people do care. And this church just has a heart for the community and for, for people. So. I decided that this would be a good thing for me to at least do something to help. Help that this group will continue to provide as they work to make this doll making workshop a first Sunday of the month tradition to try and provide these children a little piece of comfort in what may feel like their darkest days. The horrible conditions that these children are in does not define us. What defines us is the heart that goes into what we're trying to do to make it better for the children. Jalisa Rosari, Ken Spot, Bio Witness News.